Hello and a very warm welcome from us here at Crew Volkswagen dealership. Today I wanted to let you know about something a little bit different but massively unique and definitely stylish. We've been able to get our hands on this amazing Volkswagen Beetle Cabriolet in the much sought after June edition. Now if you know your Beetles and you know your history for Volkswagen you know what I'll be talking about. This car is a very nice little nod to the June edition Beetles from the 60s. And uh, as I said, this particular one is incredibly stylish and has got loads of spec available on offer. The sun is out, it's the temperatures are meant to be soaring, so why not consider getting a cabriolet and let your hair down as well. This stunning model is finished in the optional honey yellow metallic paint. It will come with lots of gizmos as well. Such luxuries will include the benefit of daytime running lights as well as full automatic headlights with automatic windscreen wipers as well. Redesigned, much more aggressive bumpers have been put on this VW Beetle. You can see here the lower section, it gives you a bit more of a, like a protective diffuser with the large honeycomb air intakes as well. And you've got prominent fog lights which also act as your static cornering lights as well. It goes without saying, massive flared wheel arches, as can be found on a Beetle as well. And to complement the looks, you even have got unique June 18-inch diamond-cut alloy wheels to complement the bodywork as well. Prominent June badging on the side seals as well. And of course, it's a full drop-down look as well. It is absolutely stunning. I particularly like the chrome strip just running on top of the door edge with the contrasting chrome wing mirrors as well. And of course, a big racing spoiler at the back it's been blacked out as well on the edge it is a really nice play and i said the black accents definitely complement the honey yellow paint as well in the rear you can enjoy led tail light technology so when traveling in the evening you have stylishly uniquely designed lights as well and again the boat term section of the bumper has also been redesigned and it features twin exhaust pipes for that sportier look as well now it is a cabriolet, it is electrically operated via a single button, but believe it or not, the way this car has been designed, you still get a very decent boot space. In this current configuration C, you can see for yourself just how much space there is here, and believe it or not, there's even the option of folding the race seats in a 50-50 split configuration, should you have any longer items to put in. Now don't panic, you don't have to climb in the back, there are quick release latches on either side, and you've got even little hooks here to hang up shopping as well. So the car has been utilized to give you maximum space where possible. I should point out in this video, to those of you who are unfamiliar with Volkswagen Cabriolets, there is a leather cover to go on this as well. Obviously nobody wants nasty exposed uh, metal hooks here and things like that. So there is a leather cover which goes for this and it beautifully covers it away and it all just hitches with two clips on either side. So it, there is something to make it look that little bit nicer. Now, as we move inside the cabin, you'll be happy to know that the outside carries on into the inside. That's right, folks, the color fully complements the overall interior looks of the car, especially all around the front of the dash and all the way into the inserts as well. Now, that paint is even stitched in the seats, which I'll tell you. Let's focus on the rear area. Very simply, quick release button and the seat sides forward. And there's seating for two in the back here featured in part leather and cloth with unique yellow piping stitching and this yellow detailing here just to really further highlight the look. If you want to bring little ones along don't panic as there's two isofix child anchor points available on either side as well for maximum comfort and they even get their own little armrest and there's an integrated 12 volt socket maybe get a USB adapter to keep the devices charged up and a single cup holder as well. To put the seat back very simply pull on the latch and it drops back easy as pie. In the front, you have unique protective kick plates and a fully redesigned leather-wrapped steering wheel, which is multifunction and even benefits from its own June badging as well. In terms of layout, there's loads to like, as I mentioned, the multifunction wheel, and there's even a touch-sensitive screen, which will have all your infotainment needs covered. With the front seats carrying over that same design, but they have that little bit more support available thanks for these lumbar supports here. And there's a manual lumbar support function available, which pushes out the lower part of the seat for maximum comfort. Once inside the driver's seat, again, it's a very nice place to be in. In case you've noticed, there's a bit of a shadow as I've put the roof up. I'll demonstrate that to you very shortly, just so obviously you can see a little bit more that's on the display here. That leather up wheel feels really nice to hold. Again, it's got yellow stitching even on the inside section. So Volkswagen has really designed this model quite well. And even you've got the speedometer access, which are usually crisp white. Again, these have been yellowed out as well to match overall feel of the car. 
In terms of controls, well, there is loads to like. In terms of your multifunction display, there's a digital speedometer to complement the large analog dial, bit of a retro touch as well. But it also has got all your fuel economy, driving speed, etc., traveling time, and it's got the uh, exact kind of range, and it's got uh, range and total distance traveled as well. In terms of other great features, you've got all your audio controls. So you've got AM, FM and DAB radio with your own Bluetooth audio connectivity, which is available as well. And there is even a driver alerts fatigue system. So should the car detect that you're getting tired, it will give you a warning as well. Automatic headlights are on offer as well. And as I mentioned, the front of the car looks really, really cool. You've got two cubby holes here, quite a nice deep one here in the above section. And there's an even deeper center glove box there as well. Now coming on to the infotainment. So this is Volkswagen 6.5 inch composition media system. It is touch sensitive with a menu option as well, but you've also got physical shortcuts on either side, which I recommend to use because it's much easier to get used to these as well. In terms of your music, both AM, FM and DAB digital radio bandings are available. But if you prefer, there is your own media source function as well for any add-ons you may wish to use, such as a CD player and that most important Bluetooth audio for wireless media streaming. Full Bluetooth telephony is also available. It's incredibly easy to pair. Just hit the Find Telephone button and make sure you enable your Bluetooth icon on your smartphone device. In terms of other great features, there's a decent sound system on offer as well, allowing you to optimize the bass, the mid and the treble in the car just for that real cool feel. And most importantly, you can even choose where the speakers focus the sound on which section of the cabin as well, which is a cool feature that not many cars have. Finally, if you ever want guidance and mapping, you'll be happy to know our App Connect system is available on this model, allowing for both Android Auto and Apple CarPlay Link, so you can now utilize mapping from your phones, like Google Maps or iMaps, or really use it for any other applications, like WhatsApping family and friends, or even listening to other music systems like Apple Music or Amazon Music, to name a few. To help with parking, front and rear audible and visual parking sensors should provide loads of reassurance for you as well. And as we move down the cabin, there's easy to use air conditioning system with AC, most important for the hot days, recirculation and a heated rear windscreen as well. And easy to obviously use where you want the air to blow. There's also engine start stop functionality for the maintaining maximum fuel efficiency. And there's a nice cubby oil for your phone with integrated USB and an auxiliary input. And again, another 12 volt socket. I quite like the cool six-speed manual gear lever. Again, it's leather wrapped with yellow stitching as well. So overall, the whole cabin is beautifully finished, integrated cup holders, and there's a, another storage here in the armrest, which is fully adjustable as well. To help you guys demonstrate the roof down operation, I've got my friend Jack here to help demonstrate. Jack, when you're ready. And it's as easy as that with a single operation. So what do you think of this stunning VW Beetle? It's certainly got the looks and the style department covered, a little nod to its heritage as well. And you can see it's got loads of spec fitted as well. Ideal for this summer or any upcoming summers as well. If you're looking for something a bit more left field and you want a nice cabriolet, why not consider this one? If you want to find out more information about this stunning car, pick up the phone now and contact our friendly sales team on 01270 864 452 or alternatively follow the link in the description below. From myself, many thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it and please feel free to post likes or if you've got any questions, put them in the section below and we'll try to answer them. And why not consider subscribing to our channel to stay up to date with all our latest content. In any case, many thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Enjoy the weather and we look forward to hearing from you.